So Dave, make us notes. You're over 50 years old, but perhaps you could tell me a little more. Certainly. Uh, yes, yeah, so like you say, we're based in Essex. We have 130 people on site, uh, and we're at the. We do a lot of aerospace work, so the kind of precision end of engineering. Uh, on site, we have three foundries: uh, investment foundry, sand foundry, and also gravity dye foundry. And all of those feed into our machine shop. So, uh, in the machine shop, we have 10 CNC machines, CNC milling machines, and three CNC lathes. So you're, you're an expert in non-ferrous alloys, essentially. Predominantly non-ferrous. We also do steels in the in the investment foundry, but yeah, 85, 90% of our business is non-ferrous uh, alloy. So what is it that makes you different? Obviously, you've got a machine shop and a foundry. Are you offering a complete service from design all the way through to finished product? That's exactly that's the key key selling point actually. In as much as uh, from soup to mince, if you like, mm -hmm. uh, castings, machining, and we can also have the finishing done on a subcontract basis. So for one purchase order, we can supply a completely finished item which is of great interest to the aerospace, defence and other industries as well. So is that where you see yourselves? You're in the high end, you know, the aerospace world? Oh, most definitely. Aerospace accounts for 55 to 60 percent of our business, a lot of which we have long term contracts in place, which takes us through maybe five or ten years of production. Uh, the defence side is similar. Uh, we're getting more and more long term contracts in place, so for which we need to be able to supply on time with a good quality. And I know you've had an award for your apprentices, so presumably you're investing in things are going well. Yeah, exactly. So we've, because of our location, we haven't got uh, a wealth of experience, engineering experience that we can, if you like, headhunt into the business. So we've identified quite some time ago that we need a strong apprenticeship so we can recruit from local schools and it all helps to, to bolster the community, really. So it sounds like things are going well, but how have Freddie products and Q8 oils helped you on your journey? Well, Q8 supply all of our uh, coolant and cutting fluid into the machine shop, so they are a key supplier from our point of view. And the uh, introduction of Freddie just over a year, just under a year ago, sorry, um, has changed the environment in which we work in. It's a lot cleaner, safer, health and safety wise. Uh, it makes a big difference from our point of view. So it's a, a partnership we see fl seeing flourishing and continuing to grow. Oh, certainly at the moment, yes, it's going very well and very encouraging from our point of view. Yes, definitely, yes. So what are your plans in terms of uh, future investment? Well, we've got quite a strong investment program. Um, currently, well, the, the latest machine that we bought is the UMC 750 to behind us. We've also recently bought a laser scanner and we're just investing in the gravity dime uh, casting area. But we'll, we'll be having some more Haas machines to grow this area and replace the older machines. Similarly, uh, the gravity dye and the sand foundry, uh, we're developing those areas as well with, with new machinery coming to those. So our, our investments are quite strong. The shareholders are more than happy to invest profits that are made back into the company such that we can push on and accrue our growth forecasts. So Martin, Q8 Oils, you're the sole supplier of engineering fluids here. It's a good relationship. Yes, yeah, certainly is, has been for several years. Um, we have the QCare system in place here where we will come on site and monitor uh, the water mix cutting fluids um, to ensure they are in good condition for the customer and the customer gets the most life possible out of the product. Mm -hmm. Is that the only advantage, life of the product? Well, it's one advantage, but obviously there's, there's other um, variables in there. We want them to run at um, the correct, um, within correct parameters for the sake of uh, their tooling life. Um, working environment, um, health and safety, um, product quality. So as well as that, you've introduced Freddy products to this company. W what was the thinking? Um, we work in partnership with Freddy. Uh, we see them as the, um, the number one manufacturer of vacuum equipment for industrial applications in the UK. Um, my time spent on site is to make sure the customer is getting the most out of our fluids. And um, I could see that there was definitely a um, an area for a Freddy EcoVac type system to be used because of the amount of swarf that is generated by the nature of what Maycast do, rather than putting the machine to downtime to extract that swarf and throw the fluid away, the Freddy will take the swarf away, filter the coolant, put the coolant straight back in, um, in literally in minutes. Um, that's very cost efficient because you're not generating waste fluid, you're extending the sump life which is good for the customer. Of course, we sell less fluid, but we think of a long-term partnership with our customers and uh, we want to make them as efficient as possible. 
typically with Freddie products, it's a 12 month or even less of a payback. Is that something we've seen here? Yeah, there's been a substantial savings in waste fluid generated. Mm. Um, again, the, the fluid that was being thrown away uh, wasn't necessarily bad fluid. It was just the process of emptying the machine for the swarf that was building up. So the fact that we are not throwing away so much fluid now is, is a big cost saving to them. And it's environmentally preferable. Exactly, and the guys, it's a much cleaner working environment as well. You know, there's a lot to be said for this. Yeah, um, the fact that the, the EcoVac also filters uh, the fluid prior to uh, replenishment is a benefit. So what products do they use here of Q8 oils? Um, the water mix cutting fluid in use at Maycast is Q8 Brunel XF343. It's uh, an aerospace um, approved cutting fluid which suits the type of industry that this company is in. Um, it is free from formaldehyde, boric acid, boron, secondary amine, chlorine. So it's a new generation product um, which is going to be legislation proof for, for many years we hope. So a company like this, they do deserve a high performance soluble cutting fluid, don't they? But you've got Freddie products as well, again, part of this. And I know they're working towards 14,001 ISO registration. So that's got to be a huge advantage having a Freddie. Yeah, absolutely. The, the partnership with Freddie is a synergy, along with other equipment supplies that we use. Um, we like to not just be seen as a fluid only supplier. We like to provide fluid, obviously, but everything else that can go with that equipment wise to make the customer as efficient as possible.